What's up guys, Kill Code Part 2 is out and I am excited to see some more Loba and Valkyrie scenes. <laughs> I know this is about Revenant and Loba's story, but come on! <laughs> Valkyrie with her marriage, like her newlywed carrying out of Kill Code 1 just got- I don't know. Anyway, well, let's watch and let's see where Revenant is in the story right now. Very excited about this. They're in broken move. Okay. Boy, he can still wall climb. They said they changed that. Death becomes me. Is that vantage? Oh, is that? What the hell? They've got enough on their hands with war. This will only complicate things. I Crypto's see. here, okay. Demonio's eye. He's involved somehow, and I won't have anyone else getting hurt. Can you do your thing with it? My <laughs> thing? <laughs> shouldn't be hard. Yo, boy! Welcome back to season four. Ever. Playing your stupid games with Loba, leave her alone. I can make it happen. What? Valkyrie is. Knock, knock. I just finished decrypting the drive, but the information is incomplete. Sorry about that. We had to jet before we could pull the whole file. Can't remember why. Fancy meeting you here. Thought you were. <laughs> What is happening, boy? It's the code for a safety protocol. Hammond, they use it on transporters that move important assets. Hammond? Our tip was that Dwarder was on Salvo. Maybe they're chasing the same thing. Mangy dogs. What asset is so <laughs> what is, I, I'm very sketchy about Valkyrie now. Across the Outlands. Maybe the asset is the tip. Go back to hell! <laughs> I know okay. what that place was. That was, was the gameplay. A revenant factory with no revenants. So the asset. Oh shit. I don't know how it was gone. I made sure. Apparently, not sure enough, cuz. <laughs> If Duardo had the head, could he control Revenant? You don't want your own personal murder box? Well, I'm not having one myself. Is it what? I'm so confused. Can you see where it's gone? No, but it seemed to have traveled a lot. And I was handling it. You know, this poor lone wolf dang and cute. <laughs> Damn right. Lifeline. You need that kid. My way's still available. Find Duardo. Start punching. Ask questions later. <laughs> if Duardo wants revenant, Maggie. it ain't for good reason. Gotta get the head and cut Duardo off at the pass. Thanks, Crypto. Yo, Opa. Damn, he hot here. Yo, crypto. You know what? For a guy who has a drone to check everything, like, I don't believe you didn't say- Oh my god, there's a part three! <laughs> 
I'm so happy. Okay, so review. It's kind of confusing. It feels like we're getting a little bit of this and that, but really we're not getting the whole story, which, you know, it's it's okay. But I'm really, really happy for Respawn. Like, you know, we've watched all of the trailers already, right? We've tried our best to follow through each and every story. And there's a lot going on. You know, like everything's almost like, it's. It, I, I, don't, I can't say it's like full circle per se. It's not like that because really we still don't know where Vantage and her mom is. So like when I look at the Apex lore, it's kind of scattered all around the place, which in the beginning I was very worried because first we got to see Octane and okay, that's Octane. And then we got to see Crypto and his sister and then we also got to see Watson and her father and then we start getting real lore like Loba Loba and Revenant's lore was actually one of those like real things where like oh there's something happening in this universe right that's the beginning of like our, our realization of like there's something amazing actually it was way back to Wraith's story she began it all and we were kind of like what is happening okay this is just the games but then when we saw Loba and Revenant's story that's where we were like oh these characters are actual human beings with real feelings and real experiences but after we saw Revenant come off we kind of got lost along the way we suddenly have Seer show in and he had his own story and then we had Vantage come in she had her own story Maggie also came in and she had her own story and then like Fuse came in he had his own story like these are like separate stories all scattered around and then Vantage came in and then Cat came in and like god knows what the lore is about anymore but now that we're actually seeing the like going back to the origins we're kind of understanding what's happening now which is really pleasant to see i absolutely love what's happening right now there's just so much going on for apex like lore wise map wise you know i know we're still mad about the ranked gameplays and there's still a lot of complaints and there's still a lot of fixing to do when it comes to the gameplay but i'm really happy that we're going back and now we understand why Maggie is here because she has her own grudge that she's trying to fix. Crypto is here as well and I also found out from my friend Car Guy that part one of the kill code, I will not confirm this like this video, but it had somewhere with Mia Crypto's sister on it. I don't know what to say about that, but I'm really happy. Like everything is so exciting. I'm excited to play again. You know what I mean? Like last year was such, no, maybe, maybe like in the beginning of this year until like last two years ago for Apex, it has been falling downhill, man. Like I love this game so much, but it was like, <sighs> Everything was just all over the place. We don't know what we're playing. Everyone's hating it. The pros are also hating it. Even content creators are leaving, but it's beautiful now. I've been playing Apex Legends every day now again, and I absolutely love what's happening. There's these like secret clues with Revenant in game. There's these glitches and everything happening in game. It's just so amazing to experience firsthand. And I'm so happy to be still here playing and stuck through it all. So I don't want to jinx it. I did have a previous video about reacting to Kill Code Part 1. I also had a video about the gameplay of playing the Kill Code in the Apex Legends game. I loved it. I had a blast. Anyway, that's all for today's video. Thank you so much for watching Kill Code Part 2 with me. I hope you're still here and do please subscribe. Thank you so much and I'll see you next time. Bye.